Call me like one of your graphs, fill my body in like a pie chart, put my name in an Excel, but like a piece of word art. On the government report. I don't think I fit. I don't think I fit into your typical narratives of an immigrant. See, when you think immigrant, I'm not the right kind of foreign, but my passport says I'm not from the country I was born in, see. It says I'm from a country that doesn't want me back. Because I'm from a demography they want to attack. In 2015, they had pictures of people like me in the streets on the knees looking like ISIS was about to put their knives to our necks. So I'm pretty sure they don't want me back. And my father and mother, they knew that, so they moved our family to the place I was born at, but we kept our old passports because we'd left family there. But our new home didn't want me yet. I spent two years in the army as a conscript, and they didn't want me yet. There was no reason given for the cancellation of their policy that soldiers become citizens automatically like my folks, except they didn't want me yet. And I had to apply on my own merits, but by that time, I'd already gotten visa to this country. A country that's, a country that's happy to take my international student money but doesn't want me either. In 2012, they scrapped the post study work visa. Before that, I'd always wanted to stay in this country for a little bit longer, but now I'm not sure. See, I've always been an immigrant, so... I know not to stay where I'm not wanted. It's like they say. One viral image on social media is a tragedy. But 1,000 new immigrants is a statistic. 1,000 new immigrants is a statistic. 1,000 new immigrants is a statistic that factors into their calculations of how to appeal to that part of this nation that just doesn't quite get it. It's not me taking your job. It's not people like me taking your jobs. It's not people like me threatening the numbers of hours in your week you spend behind a desk or in a kitchen or on a factory floor. It's not me. It's not people like me. But every time the government talks about reducing immigration, they're talking about me and people like me. Or doing their best to wreck the economy just so few rich people can stay wealthy, but they won't tell you that. True, true. Instead, they will tell you that the immigrants are flooding the country like a tide of black, brown, yellow, eastern European dirty water drowning decent people at high tide. And it's high time that they raise the floodgates and shut the borders. So the decent people, so the good people, so the people who are actually people, can keep calm and carry on. So I wonder what I look like on the spreadsheet, because I've always been unwelcome. I have always been an immigrant. I've always been unwanted, and I have always been a statistic. Thank you very much. Yes. My name is Robert Liao, and I hope you all have a good day, a good protest. And we are proud to stand with migrants. We're proud to be a migrant. And yeah, thank you very much.